O oh, servants of Allah and O oh, children of Adam, understand the essence of patience. Understand the essence of patience. Understand you as a creation. You will be tested. This is the sunnah of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala upon this creation. Allah will test as He tested His prophets before. He tested them by Allah. He tested them. He tested Muhammad ibn Abdullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala promises in His Quran, in His book, that He will test us. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, وَلَنَبْلُوَنَّكُمْ بِشَيْءٍ مِّنَ الْخَوْفِ وَالْجُوعِ وَنَقْسٍ مِّنَ الْأَمْوَالِ وَالْأَنفُسِ وَالثَّمَرَاتِ Allah says, indeed, Allah is taking a qasam, that you will be tested with fear, والجُوعِ and hunger, and poverty, وَنَقْسٍ مِّنَ الْأَمْوَالِ It's a test as well. والأنفُسِ and life, people pass away, it's a test. والثَّمَرَاتِ what does Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala say? What does Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala tell us? Allah doesn't test us and leave us without a remedy. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala talks about patience. Talks about patience. And by Allah, in a few verses before this, He says, Ista'inu bis sabri was salah. Seek assistance in patience and in your salah. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, For those who experience difficulty, and they do not use it as a means of denying Allah, but they become closer to Allah, as you seeing from this father, a grieving father, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, وَبَشِّرِ sabirin And glad tidings to the patient. الَّذِينَ إِذَا أَصَابَتْهُمْ مُصِيبَةٌ La ilaha illallah. Allah says glad tidings to the patient. Who are the patient? Those when a difficulty befalls them, afflicts them. Qalu, they say, Inna lillahi wa inna ilayhi raji'oon. They say, Inna lillahi wa inna ilayhi raji'oon. Indeed we are from Allah, and indeed unto Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala we will return. We were not made for this world. We were made for Jannah. This world is a test. Allah tested His prophets before and Allah is testing us. What does Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala say? For those who say these words, when the calamity strikes, Allah says, أُولَٰئِكَ عَلَيْهِمْ صَلَوَاتٌ مِّن رَبِّهِمْ وَرَحْمَةٌ لَا إِلَهَ إِلَّا اللَّهِ لَا إِلَهَ إِلَّا اللَّهِ Allah says, for those who say this, then upon them is salawat from Allah wa rahmah and the mercy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala upon them. Don't be short-sighted. The mercy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will come. There's two eases for everyone difficulty. You might not see the ease in this world, but by Allah, if you don't, you'll see it in an even greater way in the hereafter, when it matters. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, Wa and they are the truly guided, the rightly guided. إِذَا أَحَبَّ اللَّهُ أَحَدًا إِبْتَلَاهُ A hadith in the Sahih, Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam says, If Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala loves you, He will test you. If He loves you, He will test you. This is His sunnah, O servants of Allah. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, Surah Al-Ankabud says, Alif la Mim. أَحَسِبَ النَّاسُ أَن يُتْرَكُوا أَن يَقُولُوا آمَنَّا وَهُمْ لَا يُفْتَنُونَ Do you think it's enough for you to say you believe and you will never ever be tested? You are in the dunya, O servants of Allah. Allah is telling you that you will be tested. Allah says, وَلَقَدْ فَتَنَّ الَّذِينَ مِن قَبْلِهِمْ فَلَيَعْلَمَنَّ اللَّهُ الَّذِينَ صَدَقُوا وَلَيَعْلَمَنَّ الْكَاذِبِينَ Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says that indeed we tested those before you. فَلَيَعْلَمَنَّ اللَّهُ الَّذِينَ صَدَقُوا And by this Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will make apparent those who who are truthful when they say they believe. Those who are truthful when they say they intend Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Those who are truthful when they say we love Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. وَلَيَعْلَمَنَّ الْكَاذِبِينَ And Allah will make apparent those who are just doing lip service, but indeed are hypocrites and liars. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala shower upon us patience. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala assist us throughout our difficulties.